Welcome to Lightroom, and today we're gonna go over some quick tips inside of Lightroom Classic CC. Now these are most likely aspects of the program that you did not know existed. So we're gonna go over those, and we're gonna hit on tip number one. So I have these picture of these birds and, and what's going to make this work well is that we have nice contrast between our subject and the background. So we're going to go over to the develop module and we're going to select the adjustment brush. We're just going to double click the effect. The double click the effect is going to set everything back to zero and I'm going to darken this. The way the adjustment brush works is you paint over it in here. Let me hit command Z and undo that. We don't want the mask as I paint over it, it's gonna darken that specific area. Now I'm doing this too dark just so you can see, all right? This is not toned well, but I just want you to be able to see what I'm doing. So that's why I'm making it too dark. The issue is if we wanna darken this bird, we have to be very exact. And you can see I've got a feather over here and it's kind of blending and making it softer. And if I go outside of that area, it's gonna make a dark spot. And if I miss an area, it's gonna leave a white spot. So I'm gonna to have to spend a lot of time going over this bird to get it darkened how I want, but be exact. And that's the thing you wanna do. You wanna darken your subjects, but you wanna do things as quickly as possible. So this is gonna be a really cool trick. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna hold either the command key on a Mac or the control key on a PC. In the center of this icon is a little plus gray symbol. You do not want it to go outside of the bird. You want it to stay on the inside. That's the key for this. As I hold this down and now as I paint down, you'll notice that Lightroom is recognizing the edge and darkening right up to that point, but not going over. So I'm gonna come in here and turn on the mask so you can see how this is working. And instead of darkening the bird, we're gonna see this red mask. So I'm gonna do the same thing. But as I go out and notice I'm halfway over that bird, but it's not applying that outside of the edge of the feathers. It's just keeping it on the bird. Then we come over here and then I can darken this whole thing and it's missing that little spot and we're good. I can turn this off. Now we've darkened this bir bird and Lightroom is able to detect the edge for us and this will save you tons of time inside of Lightroom when trying to darken a specific subject. This is for tip number two. Now we have this image of this surfer and let's say I wanna darken this sky. We will come over here and grab the gradient and we're just gonna drag down. Now the idea here is I just wanna darken the sky, but I don't want to darken the subject. So what we can do is come over here and select the brush tool. Now down on the brush tool, we have the ability to actually erase. I'm gonna make my brush smaller, and then I can come in here to my subject, and I can erase that adjustment off that part of the subject. I'll come over here just so you can see what I'm doing. It's erasing from that gradient, which is wonderful. So if you ever have an object or a subject, you wanna darken the sky, but something's in the way, you can easily come over here, grab your brush tool, click on erase, and then you can erase that adjustment from your subject. Hopefully those tips have been helpful. If you have any comments or questions, you can leave those below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe.